presentation of TFNN. The Tom O'Brien Show is produced every business day. Tom takes your phone calls toll-free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. Let's go to uh, Al in Tampa. Hey, Al, what's going on? Oh, it's a beautiful thing. I mean, if your listeners don't get the gold report, they're, uh, they're missing out. I mean, you're... With your gold report, you just print in money. I love it. Uh, you're my best ad out there, Al. Let's go to uh, Jeff in New Jersey. Hey, Jeff, what's going on? Great. Uh, hey, listen, I was calling to thank you. Uh, a few weeks ago, you were prompting on your show to fill out that uh, $10,000 uh, grant. Yes. So I filled it out, and um, just a couple days ago, I found $1,000 in my business checking account. That's awesome, man. That's awesome. Yeah. And I, I owe it to you, because it, uh, if it wasn't for your prompting, I, I would have just assumed, you know, no way I would have gotten anything. So I, I wanted to thank you. No, we appreciate the growling and problem with us yet. Now, Tom O'Brien. <laughs> Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Surrender and let go of the past. Whatever life takes away from you, let it go. When you surrender and let go of the past, you're allowing yourself to be fully alive in the moment. Letting go of the past means that you can enjoy the dream that is right here, right now. Yesterday's gone. Tomorrow's not here. What are you doing right now, folks? Because that's the name of the game. Market rise! Let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 162. NASDAQ up 100, S&P's up 29, gold contract up $4.60, trading at 1770 an ounce. We have silver up 45 cents, $23.72 an ounce. Late sweet crude up 44 cents, $82.88 a barrel, notes and bonds. The 10 year note down seven ticks, 137.17. The 30 year off a full point, plus 11 ticks at 158.07 in King Dollar. King Dollar's down uh, 205 ticks, trading out here at uh, 93.748. Euro is 116, yen is at 114.30, and the British pound is at 137 to 1 U.S. dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. What do you have? We took out the swing yesterday. You took out the swing, light volume, no, no two ways about that, man. You're coming into the downdraft, the first downdraft that was created out here on September 10th. Now, the top of that is uh, 451.49. Uh, We've hit 450.56. Uh, we're coming into that with volume that's contracted in a monster way. Uh, we've done 32 million shares. I figure we'll do 40 million. Well, you're coming into 89. That being said, you have held price. If you hold price, bottom line, it's going to try to get to the top of this uh, bar, which is the uh, 451.49, which is about a point higher than it's gone so far. Today, we've hit 450.56. You're 20 cents below that right now. Your NDX 100. NDX 100 just got over the swing point that the S&P uh, bottom line has taken out yesterday. That's coming into the swing. Uh, this would have to come down a dollar to have a failure. It's uh, 374.04. That's, that's the number. Uh, it's not going to have the volume, that's for sure. We're doing 21 million shares. Uh, you're going into... 44 million, and that's not even talking about the downdraft. The downdraft out here has 60 million. Uh, we'll see what it can hold coming into the close. When we take a look at the uh, NQ futures, what you're going to see is that we just got a small sell. Uh, first one, uh, in fact, because if you, take, if you take a look at the market in general, when we opened yesterday, this has been a one-way trip on the way up. At the beginning of the market out here today, um, you got a little downdraft that down that that being said someone came in and bought a huge amount of futures man uh you know it, that thing popped in and it popped in a big way then you've gone up and what we just did do is that you got a little downdraft and it has volume on that downdraft of that uh, 362 right now you're at 387 gold gold contract here continues to want higher price we take a look at the gold contract jeez december gold out here 
Uh, trading at 1770, you get 166,000 contracts. Not bad contract volume. Uh, bottom line is gonna it's gonna need some juice to get up and over here. Okay, what we did is this: is that you had the ying as well as the yang last week. Uh, the ying going topside. We had uh, 299,000 contracts. Big day. When you pull back on Friday, we pull back with 200,000. So 200,000. Going against the strength of the 299. Yesterday you rejected lower price with 150. Now you're building cars. Pretty cool, actually, the way this is setting up. Uh, we go to the GDX. What you have inside the gold market right now, folks, is this. If you're in the gold market, it's pretty cool how this is setting up. And what I mean specifically is this. If you understand the ABC structures, we have a potential ABC structure in many of these equities. And man, it's set up nice, okay? So you know, what's really cool about an ABC structure on the way up or the way down, as it takes out the B point, you're either gonna have the volume or you don't. When you have the volume, your probability goes much higher that you're gonna get your price projection. And you can see in the GDX right now, the, the moves are pretty cool. I mean, the B point inside the GDX is 32.93, and you need 25 million shares traded. Well, we're laying right underneath that right now. If you wanna take a couple, look at a couple others, they're, they're there and they're, they're in Spain. You got Anglo Ashanti, same type of setup, and this is a big one. I mean, if that took, if this takes out the, the, the B point, the B point is 2.9 million, 19.24, um, uh, it's, it's, a, it's a big A to B. Uh, Goldfields is also a big A to B. Let me go see if Newmont, I don't think Newmont's done anything. Newmont's a lag it right now. Well, it wouldn't be a large ABC structure up, but it would be an ABC up. That's set up the same way, so pretty cool. Now, let's go take a look at the dollar because the dollar just about missed, okay, um, where I suspected it was actually gonna go for. And what it was is this, okay? So that we have a swing point out here that's back September of 2020. It's 94,742. I think we hit 94,500. 94,561. 94, then we, what happened is that we came off of that and you came off that with conviction. So conviction in the in the marketplace, okay, my definition of conviction, folks, is that you're going up or down with wide price spread and volume. Uh, we do not have volume inside the currency markets because the currency markets trade in a million different places. Well, not a million, but hundreds of different places. Um, what we did do is that we came off the high and you had conviction on the way down. Uh, 93,729 gets you inside the lower range. Now, we, we got in there today and rejected it. We'll see how this baby shakes out, but it looks to me that the way gold is trading, that the dollar does want higher price. And now let's go over to the uh, bond market, uh, because what we have inside the bond market, bond market has been going into the lower end of its consolidation. Uh, what we have out here today, the 10-year, is testing the lows of yesterday and you have a monster contraction. So my take is that what you're gonna see is you're gonna see a rejection of lower price again in the note and bond market. They want higher price as this market pulls back. That's the way it looks that it's set up. Stay right there, folks. We're gonna be coming right back when I'm at Mr. Basil Chapman. Dow Industrial's up right now, up 167. You get the NASDAQ up 104, S&P's up 30. We'll come right back. Are you looking for a way to consistently add winning trades to your portfolio? Tom O'Brien is here to help. Tom O'Brien has been successfully trading markets for over 30 years. A frequent contributor to TD Ameritrade Network and CNBC, Tom O'Brien founded TFNN over 20 years ago to help educate investors just like you. Tom's daily market newsletter, Market Insights, is published every morning when the markets open to give you the competitive informational edge you need to succeed. These newsletters are packed full of Tom's advanced technical analysis and are geared to deliver comprehensive strategies for a successful portfolio. Get Tom O'Brien's newsletter, Market Insights, today and try all of our products and newsletters 30 days risk-free with our money-back guarantee at TFNN.com. TFNN, educating investors. What's separating you from the most successful men and women on Wall Street? That's right, information. Having all the information gives us the perspective we need to place the right trades at the right time. 
The TAS Profile Scanner is the premier market profile-based scanner. Powered by its acclaimed TAS proprietary algorithms, this feature-rich scanner instantly filters over 2,500-plus global financial markets, such as stocks, ETFs, commodities, futures, and Forex. This powerful suite of tools leverages instant trade filtering and strategy formulation to show you emerging trades before they happen. For a limited time, you can save $100 off your first month by using the promo code UPGRADE. And you still get a 30-day money-back guarantee, so you have nothing to risk. Level the playing field with the TAS Profile Scanner, which you can find under the Services tab at TFNN.com. Sign up today. Sharpening your skills as an investor is like getting better at playing a musical instrument. You have to practice, sure, but you also need excellent instruction from experts. At TFNN, you'll get advice and guidance from the authority in technical market analysis. And it's not just dry, tedious text either. TFNN airs live financial content streamed live on TFNN.com and TFNN's YouTube channel with Tiger TV. Live every market day from 8.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern. For free, each host is an experienced trader and gives their take on the market while taking calls and questions live from around the world. From the moment the market opens until the closing bell sounds, Tiger TV has eight different shows with expert hosts to help you make the right moves with your money. Watch online at TFNN.com or on TFNN's YouTube channel and become the investor you were born to be. TFNN, educating investors. Call now, toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow Industrials right now up 183. You got the NASDAQ up 110. S&Ps are up 33. Let's get over to our man, Mr. Basil Chapman, as we do each and every Tuesday. Don't forget, folks, Basil has an outstanding show here every trading day, 10 to 11 Eastern Standard Time. Also a great newsletter, the opening call. Now, what Basil's doing this afternoon, right after my show at 4 o'clock from 4 to 5.30 Eastern Standard Time, he's going to be doing a great web for, webinar for all his subscribers. And you can be a subscriber right now, right here, folks, okay? The webinar is going to go for an hour and a half. Bottom line, if you're a subscriber to his opening call, you're going to get not only a great newsletter for the month, you're going to get a great webinar. He has about uh, additional uh, 10 webinars probably up there. And if the newsletter works for you, folks, that's great. If it doesn't work for you 30 days from now, you get your money back. Our man, Mr. Basil Chapman, let me, he'll, we're going to bring him on. He can tell you what this webinar is going to be all about. Couldn't be a better time for a webinar, that's for sure. Basil Chapman, what's going on, man? Well, what's going on is uh, we've got, what is it, uh, th 35, 40 minutes to go? That's and then right. we hit that webinar. I'm looking forward to it because, as you said, this is a perfect time. And I, I set this up saying I know that it's going to be a good time, but that's not the issue. The issue that I wanted to um, really deal with was what do you do now? You know, there are a lot of people that kind of lightened up, and we had lightened up going into that August the 16th high in the Dow, and uh, we were lucky to get some shorts on the downside. Everything worked out well. And as we came into the uh, lows that were made around about the 20th of September, there was a bounce and then a retest, and we decided that um, at this point, no shorts at all. We wanted to go to the long side to see whether or not these lowercase h patterns that I'll be talking about in my webinar can turn into a break of this green and red down, little mini down channel that I call the inside track repellent zone. And look how many times the Dow got repelled and then it broke out. So we, we were buying the diamonds for quick trades and then we got stopped out for, for a gain as they pull back. Then we got back in. We just missed this one, this big green bar right here. That was four days ago. But we did manage to go along at, at the, as the market dipped yesterday. I had an indicator that said there should be an early morning, uh, early morning weakness to negative in the Dow. We were able to go along the Dow. So once again, besides our core position that we have from April of last year, just, just off the lows, we actually got the day of the low with options and then we also kept the option then bought the diamonds so we still have that core position we added to it um, yesterday morning and keep treating it as a trade right now because uh, we're really close to an all-time high this is where you expect 
some kind of resistance at 35,631. We're trading at 35,439. So I thought the best thing, since we're just about to go to the webinar, is it's so difficult for people listening to say, so what does he do and what does it mean? I, you know, it's, it's like I, I was a professional uh, clarinetist uh, way, ba way back. Um, it's your last concert is what what is really important. Nobody cares about anything. That's what's important. So I'm saying, well, what would people want to know? So I spoke to you about two weeks ago. I said, we've gone long um, general dynamics. It just fitted the whole series. And this is what we're trying to look at. What should be good for the rest of 2020 into yes. 2021? And I, it seemed to me aerospace was one of the areas. So we went long. Um, General Dynamics, this is on the 7th of October at 199.38. It's trading right now at uh, 209.03 was the highest at 208.90. Nice. Uh, and this is the pattern. I look at the cup pattern. That's what we're beginning to study. We're looking at the Chapman Inside Track Repellent Zone. This is that little dashed green line. That's your target area. We're right there now. Here's another one in the weekly chart. I also spoke to you. I said that we went long PayX. And a paychex is yeah, a right. P A Y X is the symbol. So I should have hidden, put it into the right category right there. P A Y X. And we went long in the 113 area. Here it is at 121. We were long on the 5th of October. And here it is two weeks later. And we are in leg B at 121. So there are specific ideas that I have for this particular phase. We've got, we've been very fortunate. Yeah, that paychex is a nice ABC up too, man. That's. And, yeah, yeah I, I, you know, we were looking at it together. I agree. And look at the monthly chart in leg D, but nothing here is weak about this leg D. And this is a beautiful pattern that I'll be teaching. This Chapman Wave little falling axis is an expanding cone formation. If you can identify these and get the breakout, look at that beautiful move to the upside. We actually saw that in the Dow. We're seeing it now in the S&P, and even the Qs are doing that. So it's very specific, specific this move. We, we're rolling into different sectors. We also went long the GDX. I spoke to you about it the other day. I said, you know, this is the pattern. This is the upside-down pattern that we were talking about, that falling X. And it did a one-to-one -one in the weekly chart. I like the fact that the GDX has moved, had been moving up. Not gold. I prefer if gold sort of follows. This is my own belief. You're the expert, but this is where I look at it. I like it when the miners start to move because it says there's something going on there. If they just stall and gold moves, gold's more a fear factor than anything else. This is where they're moving together. So far, this is good. So this is a very nice time because I have now, I'm starting to include going back to some very low price stocks that I think have the chance to move as well. This is a perfect time for, for this. And even the stocks that we've just entered, they look like they're fairly early in this move. So there's always a chance to add to it. I think this is a very nice time to be looking freshly at the market. And there is a turnaround. And when you've got the Dow almost two, just under 200 points away from an all-time high, that is remarkable action. I mean, wow. Yeah, there's no doubt. And folks, it's very easy to come into Basil's newsletter. So come over to our website at TFNN. You're going to see the uh, opening call. You're going to see him right on the featured content for the webinar today. Uh, you're going to subscribe to his newsletter. It's $149 for one month. It's $6.95 for six months. You save $199 at 22%. You can get it for a year for $11.95. You save $593 at 33%. Now, they all come with a 30-day money-back guarantee. So you come over. You subscribe. If it works for you, great. Bottom line, if it doesn't work for you for some reason, you get your money back, you come into a great new um, webinar, and you learn how to ride that Chapman wave. And Basil has a huge amount of other webinars out there that you're going to be able to take advantage of. Uh, Basil, off, uh, this is off, off topic, okay, because I know you, you're getting ready for your webinar, but I just got to get this feedback from you. Um, prices, rising prices, what are you hearing when you're out there in, in the world? Well, it's, it, that's very interesting because this is the first time that I'm hearing from people who really just don't discuss prices because, you know, they live within their means and whatever it sure, is, right. that's fine. But all of a sudden they're saying, you know, I can't believe the And then they name the prices. Well, you and I have been talking about prices. I mean, just like uh, some cheese products that you would pay 225 or something for uh, a year and a half ago, jumped to three something, and now they're at four. So they're, this is just cheese. I mean, yeah. this is processed cheese. Right. So I didn't, this is, it's, it's affecting everyone.
but it's really the price of gas. And I'll be talking about that as well because the oil service sector has done well. We, we've sort of skipped that sector. We're going to be looking for the next pullback there to start position. So I, I think this is something we have to take seriously, um, just to be aware of that prices have every, every single thing you, you look at. The There's price no is doubt. I mean, oil is high. Just so, just so you can wrap your head around this, folks, okay? So from August 23rd to now, oil uh, bottom line went up $20 a barrel. $20 a barrel. I mean, that affects it. It's like a yeah. tax. Huge. Yeah. Huge. Well, listen, man, you have a great one, safe one, and uh, you are going to be live in 34 minutes, and I can't looking wait. Looking forward to it. It should be great. Totally, Thank man. You so have much a great fun. one. Have a safe one. You're Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back. Are you having fun trading the markets, but having trouble finding like-minded individuals to discuss your trading and investment ideas with? Become an apex predator in the trading markets and join the Tiger's Den Trading Room only at TFNN.com. The Tiger's Den is an exclusive trading room where successful traders from around the world come to exchange trades and ideas. Join the den and surround yourself with the sharpest minds in the trading world. Subscribers to the Tiger's Den are also the first to have their questions answered live on air and can privately chat with our TFNN hosts live during their shows. Interact with other Tigers and Tigresses as they share trading ideas, news analysis, and discuss the market action all trading day. Subscribe to the Tiger's Den risk-free with our 30-day money-back guarantee and become part of the TFNN trading community. TFNN, educating investors. You could be making money off the stock market. And if you're already making money off the stock market, you could be making a lot more. Check out TFNN and Tiger TV and get expert investing advice to give you the power to control your financial future. Go to TFNN.com and find the newsletter for you. Whether you're into trading gold, metals, futures, currencies, or options, you'll get advice and analysis to help you seriously get ahead. TFNN also features trading services with a 30-day money-back guarantee for new subscribers, as well as TFNN's Tiger Den Trading Room, trading software, and educational webinars for all trading levels and make sure you check out tiger tv for free on tfnn.com or tfnn's youtube channel for live financial content from 8 30 a.m to 4 p.m eastern on market days stop watching on the sidelines while other people get rich and become the investor you were born to be tfnn educating investors TFNN is excited about our new software charting program, The Art of Timing the Trade Charts. In collaboration with Tom O'Brien and using his best-selling book, The Art of Timing the Trade, Your Ultimate Trading Mastery System, David White has programmed an outstanding piece of software that will complement any trader's methodology. Using this first-of-its-kind program, The Art of Timing the Trade Charts allows you to scan thousands of stocks for Fibonacci formation setups, including Gartley's, ABC's, Butterflies, and much more. The Art of Timing the Trade Charts is designed to help you when scouring the markets for stocks just beginning to form the trading patterns that many investors spend days, weeks, or even months searching to find. And right now, we're offering licenses available at only $79 a month. We are so confident that you're going to love this new charting software that will even give you a 30-day unconditional money-back guarantee. Don't miss out on this incredible new piece of software. Get your copy of The Art of Timing the Trade Charts today by visiting TFNN.com. This segment is brought to you by Think or Swim. For more information, just click the Think or Swim banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow Industrial is right now up uh, 161. We get the NASDAQ up 103. S&Ps are up 30. Let's take a look at this Dow Industrial. So uh, Dow Industrials, we... As Basil just said, this is pretty impressive, man. <laughs> I mean, the, the high that was generated out here uh, was the 35,631. So you're a couple hundred points away from it. Uh, bottom line is that, you know, you came down hard and fast to the 3,300, 600, and then you flip right around and go right back topside again. Uh, inside of the Dow Industrials uh, today, the strength versus the weakness. What we have is that you have Johnson & Johnson putting the 23 positive points, Amgen 21, Walmart 19, Caterpillar 18. Taken away from it, Goldman minus 15, Nike 14, Procter & Gamble 11. Uh, if we go to Procter & Gamble, they come out with their numbers. Uh, good numbers, uh, bottom line, uh, they uh, 
you know, traded down to 138. They're at 140, 59 right now. And I suspect what's inside of those, well, what they said is inside of those flat out. Um, they took in in 90 days, they took in uh, a 20.3 billion to the top line. They brought to the bottom line $1.61. Uh, and inside of that with the market, I, I suspect didn't like at the beginning, but uh, they, they start buying it anyway, uh, was the aspect of um, rising uh, kind of, well, rising transportation costs. They're talking about uh, 2.2 uh, $2 billion uh, that they're, they're looking that uh, they're going to be coming up with. And, and that totally makes sense because, you, you know, guess what? You, you're doing $20 billion a quarter. $2.2 billion is not the end of the world. Um, there's no doubt. Netflix, NFLX. Let's take a look at it, man. So you got Netflix out here. Uh, Netflix right now is trading at a price point of 637 and they are going to be looking for, let's take a look at this for a second. So Netflix is going to be looking to do 7.5 billion, top line, $2.56 to the bottom line. Look at this growth, man. This growth in Netflix is unbelievable. And just so you can get your head straight on this, folks, you can take all the rest of the streamers, Amazon, Disney, I don't know, Spectrum, take, take whatever you want, put them all together, and they're still not as big as Netflix. Netflix is the monster out here. So they're growing in the United States by 6% a year. They're growing in Europe, the Middle East, and Africa by, uh, let's see, 15% a year. Latin America, they're growing by 8% a year. Asia, they're growing by 20% uh, a year. Monster numbers, man. Okay, so now let's figure out what they might say. Let's see. So we'll put this on a weekly first. Okay, so I took out the whole consolidation. Now you got, oh, this, is, this is an ABC up, man. Okay, hold, here we go. 615. That's 110 A to B. Let me see if I already finished it. 568, 668, 678 was the number. It's not finished it yet. 678. See, I, I just put this on a, 678 is the number, man. That's, that's the number. And, yeah, my take is we're going up, we're going up. That's what that's going to be looking like. So this will be interesting when this comes out. And Netflix comes out right away, folks, right at 4 o'clock. That, that number will be banging out there in spades. Some of the higher volume equities out here in this low volume market. Uh, we have, let's see, you have uh, Apple's up buck seventy-five. You get Tilray up $156. Um, AMC's down 136 You get uh, Advanced Micro off 34 Macy's is down the dollar seventy one. That had quite a move. Uh, when they're talking spinoffs, they're talking uh, real estate, really. Uh, so let's go over to Canopy. One second, because we got Tilray moving. These these pot stocks have just get absolutely smoked. They've been looking for a bottom. Oh man, they might have find one. Okay, here we go. Thought it get a little bit lower, but here. So we bring this back. Let's do this first in a five year. So I have canopy growth up here. So you had $9 was the last low on the weekly. That's bringing it back. Oh, that's a swing point. Yeah, this might be, uh, this is something you might want to get on your radar, man. Yeah. Yeah. I'd get this on your radar. I'm going to start trading this again. This looks to me like uh, you're, you're coming off the lows. What we did last week is that you came off the low with 20 million shares. We went lower the week before with 17 million. The 17 million was going into strength of 39 million. The strength started at $14.30. Now, we haven't got the 14.30 yet. Right now, you're at 14.21. Uh, we'll, we'll see how that shakes out. But let me, see, what, what brought this up on my screen, folks, is that when I was just doing the uh, high volume equities, even in this low volume market, it's that Tilray came up. And we know Tilray's <laughs> a psycho stock, man. I mean, tell you, oh, look at this. Look at this. Went up $1.51. Now, why is that going up? Let's see. Besides buying. Uh, oh, CNBC pushing it. Okay. So, um, we get a good man, John Nigerian, out there, co founder of Market Rebellion. Uh, saying that the call options had high volume. You know what's amazing, folks, is that, too, when I, when I think about, you know, we, we've been doing this for so long. Uh, John 
his brother and uh, Tom Howe used to have a show on TFNN. In fact, they were one of the first shows outside of me. Yeah, they were. And that was for a couple of years, man. Uh, they used to do a show out of the CME. So, pretty well. He's a great guy. That's the real, that's the real bottom line. King Dollar. King Dollar wants to lower price. Uh, uh, that's where I want to go. I want to go to the note and bond market. Okay. Let's go to the note and bond market and take a look at this. Okay. So, the 30-year bond is down a full point plus 10 ticks. So, every 32 ticks, folks, is a point. You're coming into strength. Yes, yesterday we went down with uh, 431,000 contracts. Today it's 322. The 322 is going against uh, 519. That's still telling me that you're going to get a rejection of lower price and it wants higher price. And I suspect what the higher price is, by the way, okay, folks, is that like right now the 10 year, the 10 year is trading, uh, is yielding 1.63. The If the market pulls back at all, you are actually going to see that go to higher price, lower yield. And, you know, what does, what is happening right now in the mortgage market, okay, is that, so, so picture, if you remember when we had one of the mortgage brokers on, when the, when the price was going down, the mortgage market wasn't catching up with it. And the reason was that there was so much demand versus supply, right? It, well, you have the opposite effect right now. It's not like, you know, you, you go get a mortgage, and mortgage is very inexpensive, and they're not moving with the 10-year. Because guess what? Because what ends up happening is that we're at such a low level right now that you've had the amount of refinances that have taken place of huge. The amount of new houses that are coming on, that's, that's been tougher because the, the fact of the matter is there's a shot of, of houses out there. And so the mortgage market basically is staying low because of that. That's a, a true supply and demand deal. And it, it's in spades out here, too. Dow, Dow Industrial is right now up 158. The NASDAQ is up 100. S&Ps are up 28. And we'll see uh, how this market shakes out. And we will look at uh, silver and platinum. Absolutely. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. Are you in the market for buying or selling real estate in the Bay Area, including the surrounding St. Petersburg, Tampa, and Clearwater markets? Tiger Real Estate LLC is a firm that has extensive experience in the Tampa Bay Area. Whether you're looking to sell your current property for maximum value, or you're in the market for a second home or investment property, Tiger Realty has the experience across all areas of real estate in the Tampa Bay area to help buyers and sellers make the most informed decisions across all price levels. From the price you should be paying per square foot in certain up and coming areas to the type of cash flow investment properties are capable of creating, Tiger Real Estate can help you make the best decision when it comes to all areas of the market. Before you make one of the biggest decisions of your financial future, call Tiger Real Estate LA. LC today at 727-329-8322 or email us at tiger at tfnn.com. That's 727-329-8322. Call us today. The technology around us is changing every day. With so much happening, it can seem impossible to keep up with all the information. David White's investment newsletter, The Technology Insider, is designed to give you all the information you need to understand the technology that shapes today's markets and tomorrow's future. David White has made his living staying on the cutting edge of technology. His weekly newsletter will give you specific recommendations for value tech stocks, as well as entry prices, target prices, and stops to set for each trade. Dave delivers his weekly newsletters every Friday with updates throughout the week. You can get the Technology Insider at TFNN.com for only $37.50. Sign up for David's newsletter, The Technology Insider, and get an inside look at everything the technology sector has to offer. Try it risk-free today with our 30-day money-back guarantee. TFNN, educating investors.
Biotech is booming, but for how long? Whether you think the biotech bull has room to run or has run its course, trade LABU or LABD. Direction's daily S&P Biotech three times bull and bear ETFs. Visit directioninvestments.com slash biotech today. An investor should consider the investment objectives, risks, charges, and expenses of the Direction shares carefully before investing. The prospectus and summary prospectus contain this and other information about Direction shares. To obtain prospectus or summary prospectus, please contact Direction shares at 866-476-7523. The prospectus or summary prospectus should be read carefully before investing. An investment in the funds is subject to risk, including the possible loss of principal. The funds are designed to be utilized only by sophisticated investors such as traders and active investors. Distributor Foresight Fund Services, LLC. Call now. Toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. I'm Orion. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow Industrials right now up 151. The Nasdaq's up 94. S&Ps are up 28. Our guest today, folks, is Lisette Hanowitz. Lisette is a candidate for the St. Petersburg City Council. Uh, she moved to St. Petersburg, Florida in 2006 and fell in love with it, as we all do when we get here. It's a beautiful thing. She worked in the Office of State Attorney, uh, State Attorney of the Sixth Judicial Circuit for the United States Attorney's Office, also for the Middle District of Florida. Uh, she started her own practice in 2014 and uh, she uh, is uh, uh, the president of the uh, Crescent Lake uh, Neighborhood Association and she's uh, uh, been involved with many of uh, the communities uh, the neighborhoods inside of St. Pete for quite some time. Lisette, welcome to TFNN. Thank you. I'm very excited to be here. It's a beautiful thing. Well, we, we appreciate all the work you've done out there and I know that you're uh, in a, a battle out here, as all you politicians are in a battle, you get two weeks coming up. Uh, so oh, it's a battle, yeah. <laughs> that's right. I, that's a beautiful thing. Uh, so tell us why we should vote for you. Well, I will tell you, I never even imagined running for office. Um, but, you know, it is something that, you know, life brought me to. Um, I got involved in the Neighborhood Association back in 2016. Um, I had a high-risk pregnancy, and we decided that I'd stay home. I'm a former state and federal prosecutor. As an attorney, um, I will tell you that I saw how my legal skills could help the community in our neighborhood. Yes. I built, yep, I built the organization, the neighborhood organization from the ground up. We have over 25% of our neighborhood involved. That's over 500 households, and through that, I've assisted people on issues, whether it's transportation, uh, safety issues. We engage the community to support our zoned elementary school, Woodlawn Elementary, getting mentors in and building a learning garden. I've been part of uh, the Council of Neighborhood Associations. So I just want to continue the work that I've already been doing in the community on city council. Yeah, yeah and you've definitely built, you know, I, I can tell you from, I build a lot of houses in different communities in the Crescent Lake. What happens, folks, is that Crescent Lake has always been a very strong um, neighborhood, but you really made it a beautiful neighborhood. The porch parties. Come on down to St. Pete, folks. It's a beautiful thing. So l let me ask you, what do you think of the challenges right now for St. Petersburg? You know, right now, I'll tell you, I'm, I'm born and raised in Florida. I was born in Tampa, raised in Miami, and life brought me back to the Tampa Bay Area in 2004, been in St. Pete since 2006. And I'll tell you, St. Pete's growing. I mean, it's clear. Um, it's been growing for a while. That's, that's a challenge it's going to have. Um, like any growing city, um, you have um, the growing pains. Yes. Um, how do you keep? How do you keep? You know, what makes our city cool and what brought us here in the first place? You know, while it grows, uh, clearly we have the infrastructure issues. Also, and then of course, because of all this growth and everything, we have affordable housing issues. So I think those are the challenges we have right now. And, you know, what has happened, folks, across the country is that single-family housing, uh, you know, everyone has talked about affordable housing forever. I mean, my whole lifetime, that's all I've heard, and nothing ever gets done about it. And one of the big challenges for all communities is that everyone says they want it, but not in my backyard. That's, that's kind of right. the mantra right across the whole country. So what has happened is that in certain communities, they're saying, okay, no more single families. It doesn't have to be single family houses. You can put duplexes, you can put triplexes, you can put quads. And 
right now, actually, last uh, Thursday night, I was listening to that, that council meeting, and at the council meeting, they were pushing forward that that 90% of the city of St. Petersburg uh, just may uh, have new zoning. And wh what do you think about that? Well, I will tell you right now, the city's going through the Vision 2050 process, which, you know, it's a planning process that is going to end up making changes to our comprehensive plan and, and in turn our land development regulations. Yes. Um, and what that does is it's going to, you know, they're going to look at the city and see where uh, there can be zoning changes to increase density and zoning in certain areas. I don't know if specifically it's going to happen citywide and there's going to be upzoning everywhere. I think, you know, what's going to happen is through the public engagement process, you're going to start having a better vision of where and how you can do it. And I will tell you, I, I hate the word YIMBY and NIMBY and all that because once you start with names, it shuts people down. So if you go to a neighborhood and, and you tell them, well, you, you guys are just a bunch of NIMBYs and not hear what the issues are, it's a problem. Um, and you have to engage communities to figure out what is the concern? Is it parking? Is it gentrification? Is it density? And why? And and have those conversations. Um, because I've at least I've learned as a neighborhood president, listening and engaging people and having a conversation, you'd be surprised where you get to. Um, what you meant in terms of the difficulty and the not in my backyard mentality, I will tell you some of the most established neighborhoods in our city have a variety of housing. They, ha they have a variety of housing, but the fact of the matter is, is that when these regulations basically come out to the community, and you know, they, it was one of these that, yeah, let's say I have an, an ADU, which is a garage right. apartment, folks, okay, right. and I'm in a certain part of the city, and there is a, there is plenty of people that even though if I had one, I'd say, no, I don't want anyone else to have one. So, I mean, I, I listen, I, you have challenges. <laughs> all all oh, city I, councilors I, I, have I, challenges, I, there's no doubt. Uh, you know, I, oh, I, I, I'm just bringing it up because that's what you're going to be walking into, you know, if you happen to win your, your seat inside the city council. I, I Trust me, I've walked into it here as a neighborhood president. I will tell you that we had issues in our neighborhood when they built modern homes um, and you know, people, and this is back in 2015, you had 2017. Right, I was there, and I, I know exactly what you're talking about. Yeah. Okay, and, and people were up in arms. But I will tell you this, though, Tom, when as soon as you ask people, you know, okay, well, do you want to go ahead and, 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 and change it to a, a local landmark district? You know, if you want to take away their rights, that means you want you want to also change your rights. Oh, well, no, 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 no. People don't want to do that. They That's want to limit what their neighbors right. People want to limit what the neighbors do, but they don't necessarily, if we would have had a vote of the neighborhood where it's like, okay, well, we're going to limit this throughout the neighborhood. You'd be surprised how much people like their property rights. So, so you know, it, it, it is interesting. They always want to tell someone else what to do, but a lot of times they don't want to apply it to themselves. With the zoning issues, I will tell you, um, you're right. I mean, accessory dwelling units are definitely an option that we don't have throughout the city um, because the zoning doesn't allow it throughout the city. And that's a good um, option to have for affordable housing. And not only helps the person that lives in the accessory dwelling unit and it can conform, by the way, a lot of times people are concerned about the character of the neighborhood. You can make them conform to the character of the neighborhood, but you can have the accessory dwelling unit, what allows for a single person or a college student or even a small family to live there and then it also helps the homeowner right yes. because yes they they collect rent so you know and just like the middle housing you know duplexes and triplexes i've seen some new ones that they have designed where you would not no, right? It's a duplex automatically. Yeah, there's no, there's no doubt. Well, listen, I, I wish you the best. Um, I love how you think, and that must be the the attorney, because 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 no, it's really cool what you said. I mean, the aspect just bringing it back to anyone, not in general. That hey, listen, you know, you know, okay, well, do you want other restrictions on it? You know, that's right. Well, listen, you have a great one, safe one. We wish you luck, and we'd like to have you back. Thank you so much, Tom. Take care. Okay, have a great one. Have a safe one. Okay, bye. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.
Sharpening your skills as an investor is like getting better at playing a musical instrument. You have to practice, sure, but you also need excellent instruction from experts. At TFNN, you'll get advice and guidance from the authority in technical market analysis. And it's not just dry, tedious text either. TFNN airs live financial content streamed live on TFNN.com and TFNN's YouTube channel with Tiger TV. Live every market day from 8.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern for free. Each host is an experienced trader and gives their take on the market while taking calls and questions live from around the world. From the moment the market opens until the closing bell sounds, Tiger TV has eight different shows with expert hosts to help you make the right moves with your money. Watch online at TFNN.com or on TFNN's YouTube channel and become the investor you were born to be. TFNN, educating investors. You might think that if you want to be successful at trading in the stock market, you're going to need a crystal ball. After all, it's impossible to predict the future, right? Like any endeavor in life, before you decide it's impossible, get some advice from the experts. You might find that it's not so impossible after all. For daily market overviews that give you direction on the key indices, selective stocks, and commodities, subscribe to the opening call newsletter at TFNN.com. The opening call newsletter is written by Basil Chapman, creator of the trading methodology known as the Chapman Wave. The Chapman Wave up-down sequence gives you an edge in identifying price turns, finding the peaks and valleys in stock prices. Get the opening call newsletter by Basil Chapman in your inbox every day. First-time subscribers also get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you're not satisfied, let us know, and you'll get a full refund within 30 days of signing up. TFNN.com educating investors are you looking for a secured investment which pays you on a monthly basis the tiger first mortgage program may be the program for you the best rate on a five-year cd in the country right now according to bankrate.com is paying one percent per year or one thousand dollars per one hundred thousand dollars invested the tiger first mortgage program pays seven percent per year paid monthly on secured high value buildable properties in saint petersburg florida the investment is for four years, paying 7% per year or $7,000 per $100,000 invested. Your investment is secured by high value real estate in St. Petersburg, Florida. Your investment can be anywhere from $100,000 to $500,000. Do you want to make $1,000 per year on $100,000 invested or $7,000 per year on a secured Tiger First Mortgage? The Tiger First Mortgage Program may be just the program for you. The Tiger First Mortgage Program pays 7% per year paid monthly. For more information, you can call 877-518-9190. That's 877-518-9190. Don't forget, you can listen to TFNN live on your mobile device 24 hours per day. Go to TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. That's TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. Welcome back, folks. Uh, silver. Let's go take a look at that silver market out here for a couple of the Tigers. So silver got a good pump up today. It has price movement. It has volume. Uh, we got 75,000 contracts traded. We probably got an ABC structure up here, man. Yeah, we do. Okay, so let's see what we got. Okay, so taking that point out, that's 23.32. Yeah, it's only 30 cents. Bottom line is showing a sign of strength, though. That's my, my take is that Silver wants to make this run out of 26. Uh, platinum, P-L-A-T. Let's go take a look at the Platinum active contract. Right now, Platinum is trading up 440 or at 1,042. And this is building cause for a higher price. I mean, I, th this broke the, its whole downtrend. I mean, Platinum, to me, it looks like it's going to go 1,280. Right now, you're at 1,042. Actually, let's bring this back. I'll do this on a c continuous contract and put this on a weekly. And yeah, you can see on a weekly, man. We, we this this is this is gonna make a run, man. Yeah, twelve forty-two is game. And then good old Vista Gold, who, which hasn't done anything. Uh, Vista Gold, bottom line. I expect it's got higher prices coming at us, uh, all you tigers and tigresses out here. Um, if you, one of the tigers has traded it a lot, there's no doubt, as, as, I, as I have. Uh, this is always a different 
being. Uh, right now we're at 75. I think this thing wants to go to 95. And w when it does trade, folks, by the way, that'll pop out of like nowhere and just move. That's that's kind of how this thing uh, trades. The broker dealer, whoever's the, the uh, broker dealer on this, has that stock strangled, and they have for a long period of time. There's there's no doubt about it. Don't forget, folks. Coming right up right now, our man, Mr. Basil Chapman. He's going to be growling a problem. You can jump over to our website, jump in that uh, webinar right now. And always remember, folks, the bear can claw your heart out, the bull can run you over, and thank God there's always another trade. Health, happiness, and prosperity. Have a great night. Have a safe night. Come back and visit Tommy tomorrow morning. Kicks us off 9 o'clock in the morning. Great show. Wow! Look at him, folks. Building wealth 